allegations. Instead of blaming anyone else for putting the children in the freezer, she's taken responsibility for that part of the crime right away. When the moving crew first opened the freezer, they found a teenage girl's frozen body inside. She was completely naked and covered in frost, except for a large black plastic bag that was placed over her. Her head was pressed against the inner side of the freezer wall, where there were blood stains next to her face. A long piece of black fabric, possibly a silk scarf, was still fastened around her neck, and there were notable injuries to her throat, her right cheek, right brow, her bicep, and her chest. Under the girl were several blankets, but because her body was frozen to the side of the freezer, only a portion of the blankets could be cut away. But the police were able to cut a hole, which revealed another frozen body hidden under the first. This one, a preteen boy. Neither body was able to be removed from the freezer, and instead, the entire thing was sent to the Wayne County Medical Examiner.